Hi everybody, uh, good afternoon. I got a request to do this room. It's easy room, uh, but in any case someone asked me to do it, so let's go through it. This is about container, virtualization container. Most of now we're doing container and less than virtualization. Virtual technology, as you know, is a VMware, is a while ago, decrease expensive scale, efficiency, that yeah, we still use them like most of the time virtual box and all of that so it still it still exists so it's not like uh, um, it's not important everybody know what uh, virtualization so you can read about it so is scalability a primary benefit of course so the whole point of virtual so you go scale uh, scalability is important what is the operating system of virtual machine is a guest OS that is clear that's what we call them a guest a guest OS now let me come back to this because there's two two machines we need to start let me we we'll come back to that so let's do the docker first the docker containers for more information about intro to docker room our machine hand on application they said uh, before starting a docker container you must first endorse two few two new flags that must be used the run command to allow the container to detach from the current terminal minus d and and the uh, exposed port 5000 so we, we so we can access to it to verify that the web service is running in the docker container we can scan the container or access designated port in web server so let's let's see docker why no this is pull this this first uh, docker ps let's check the list of the dockers we have in oh Uh, let's get docker this why is not docker run minus p we expose in port 5000 minus d cry nick try hack i didn't think i'm not sure it's just Did I miss something? Containers. We need to get first the container. We need to pull first uh, the container. What's the name of that container? Cry leaked. Cry leak. Try hack me example that app let's get it first using the photo glaze test So I did this room before. What's wrong here? Um, I'm going the same name. second guys when you make a video and you get confused we can ask through SSH before studying docker container we must first include two new flags the minus D uh, hmm. 
Doka habu is a remote repository for Docker, similar to GitHub remote repository for Git. Using Docker Hub, we can pull Docker images created by other and push it down. So, uh, to verify the server number, uh, it will see copy all characters. Um, hmm. Let me, let me SSH to the box. Sometimes, ay, 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 when you do live videos and then suddenly I'm, I'm getting uh, lazy to to reset this video. Let's follow. Uh, let's follow if, if I find my mistake without resetting this video on 12.19. I remember when I did this in my room before, it was no issues. Try hack me, exclamation mark. ID, I'm a user, okay. Look, Docker PS has nothing. Docker run. I might type in it wrong for whatever reason. Let me copy so I can't. Let's wait for it. Somehow now it's working for whatever reason. Do not use the production deployment. Okay, now we got it, so... Let's see what it is. Docker, okay, seven debug mode on. Warning, this is development server. Do not use it in production deployment. Running all addresses zero zero. Uh, what command we did? Oh, we did run. Ay, 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 ay. Uh, it's only by default in the fifty fifty. Let me console this. Oh, yeah, yeah. What's going on? Let me do this. Docker pull. I want to control. Uh, Why the SSH is dying for whatever reason now? So the pull doesn't work, so le le let's run the whole thing one shot my again in SSH and let's see what happens. Oh, it's working now. So if I get docker ps, docker ps, okay, it give me port 55, 5000, then kind harvisky, uh, the, the, the name of the, f so if, if everything was correct, so if I go now to the, this address, the 5000, So let's try it. Okay, we got the flag. Oops. 
So the pool didn't work for whatever reason. I'm not sure why it didn't work. So we have. Uh, so that's fine. The reason why I study because now we have this another one. I need to start the machine again. So to do that, I need to shut down this. Then we can start this machine again, and then we time and go to the hypervisor. Finish this question quickly here. So. The hypervisor is like the one we call them bare metal, like uh, this is VMware, I think. The VMware uh, is often handless with only web based managed portal remotely accessed. The hypervisor are designed to scale and deploy a large number of virtual machines. And then this is the, the hypervisor type 1, it's bare metal. And then the hypervisor type 2, which we usually we got used to it, is usually when you do virtual box. Fusion, all of that. This one are known and hosted hypervisor. Well, most we use the virtual box. So, so if you do what type of hypervisor is the virtual box? Is called is type two. Then what what are type one hypervisor also known as? Triple hyper number one hypervisor also known as bare metal hypervisor. So. So that's another answer for that. Container is a new hot topics. Uh, hypervisor work in a large number of use, use cases, but begin to encounter issue when scaling lightweight application microservices, and this is where the container came from. Uh, the container, Kubernetes, and all of that, they share the container have their own file system, portion of the computer resources, access space, and more. Container engine are, are our second type of virtualization, and virtual machine use a hypervisor to create abstraction layer for virtualization. And then, are container completely abstract from the host operating system? No, uh, they are not. Um, they're not completely, they still have connection to the system. No, uh, sorry, this is not. Uh, no, we did this room. It's just to, to do the application. And then the next one is that couple of question is the Kubernetes. Also shown for K8 is a solution known as Arco uh, orchestration platform. So horizontal scaling extend extensibility self-healing this is very uh, interesting part of it automated rollout and rollback this is also good for uh, if you do mistake you can roll back strict uh, easily so now let's let me go back to my attack box machine is still starting my IP this time is 139.137 the user is the same. Let's see if it's yes. Try hack me. Hopefully, someone of guys you win because I tried and didn't win for this uh, security engineering. Uh, before presidential, all cluster has started by running mini mini cube. Minikube is the one to, if you want to start uh, insta uh, installing Kubernetes in your, uh, in, your, uh, in your computer locally to play around with the Kubernetes if you want to pass the exam, Kubernetes administrator, some things like that. So let's wait for it. We're starting this Docker container. This is how to, to do that. This is the learning path for the security engineering. I, yeah, it's a bit too many rooms here. I don't know why they said I didn't do this. I did this one. I finished them. They suddenly now they this they said I didn't do them. I don't know what's going on. Okay, we did that. Let's wait for it. How many pods are running in the provide cluster? I think uh, what they call that command for uh, Kubernetes. Qu um, yeah, well, yeah, could be CTL get pods. I remember from the exam of a uh, uh, Kubernetes administrator, could be, could be CTL. It's a take time now. She's supposed to start this machine uh, first. In any case, we need to wait for it. So, let's 
most of the question you can do them because they already tell you the commands here so you just follow okay let's wait for them uh, I'm just this is my second video for today I start with the one for the city of the new one Athena okay it's uh, starting somewhere okay 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 so we we can start guys let's do this quickly uh, could be CTL get pods um, why this uh, the shell is, is dead or something could be CTL get pods how many uh, how many pods are running on the provide cluster well, only one pod so and then how many system pods are running on the provide cluster I think we need to do what uh, minus a for the whole thing could be could ctl get pods minus a minus a so we can pass the whole thing how many of them uh, one two three four five six seven system said uh, system one two three four five six seven the question is about system so that's not part of the it's not system so it's seven what is the pod name on the provided cluster we already did this the provided uh, pod name is this one hello yeah I told you this so we already passed that one okay and then what is the deployment name and the provided cluster I think could be see a get deployment let's see could be let's not go be CTL get deploy you can you don't need to write the whole what you need to write the whole thing could be CTL get deployment that's very strange because when I did the exam for I didn't need to type the whole word so hello what's the name for the deployment is hello and then what port is exposed by the service in equation 5 what's equation 5 1 2 3 4 5 this one what port is exposed by the service in uh, I think could be still uh, get uh, uh, get services a I need to revise what port is exposes so w w you access to from the outside uh, this is the cluster IP that's the our uh, our pod the hello try hack me you access to it from 880 and then the cl the the docker image the kubernetes that's the IP so that's 8080 then how many replica sets I think could be still get replica set get RS yeah replica set could be CTL get RS could be CTL get RS replica set we have one and then what is the replica set name on the provided cluster uh, that's the name of it And then what command will be used to delete the deployment from question 5? It should be kubectl delete deployment and the name. Let me let me guess kubectl delete deployment it's hello what the hell what command you will be used to delete deployment from question 5 
Uh, uh, deployment name is this. Mm. Okay, so so that's all the questions. So we delete it like that. The conclusion. We brief you. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay. Okay, guys. Hope. Let me. I already did this room. That will not give me anything new. Let's have hope. Let's see. Oh, you already read him the ticket. Any case, that is quick uh, walk through, guys. Because someone asked for for this room. Maybe it helps someone else. Uh, enjoy it. Have a good weekend and goodbye.